Peter, I need you to take Chris and Meg to school. Today's the day I finally kill that squirrel that's been eating our tomatoes. Try to get like eight of them this time. I want to make bruschetta. Oh, can't the kids just walk? You know I like to watch two full movies before I go to work. No, Peter, they can't walk. It's three miles. <sighs> Fine, I'll take them. But you better keep those goggles, because I'm going to put them to good use tonight. Once the floor is full of sawdust, we can eat peanuts in here. Dad, are you sure it's okay that we took Brian's car? Yeah, it's his own fault. He's the one who keeps his key in the visor like a carefree hillbilly. Okay, everybody out. I don't want the cool kids to know I'm your dad. Hey, Chris. Guess who I just scored as my date to the homecoming dance? Vice Principal McGuire. Really? Yeah, her husband just died of ALS, so she is ready to get at it. Hey there, strong guy. Not now, Brenda. She says I have the body of a 50-year-old before it gets ALS. So who are you going to go with? I was thinking of asking Kara Morris. Why don't you ask her now? Her locker's right over there. Um, uh, yeah, okay. Hi, Kara. I was wondering, um, if you'd like to go to the homecoming dance with me. Oh, hi, robot from Big Hero 6. No, but thank you. His name is Baymax, you gorgeous moron! All right, red light. Time to text and shave and whittle and floss. Thanks for getting here so quickly. What? I'm sorry, you're in a Prius. I just assumed you were my Uber. I don't know what that is on account of being dull. Uber. It's like a cab, except it feels like a game because it's from your phone. Anyway, I'm late for a meeting. Can I just give you 20 bucks to drop me off? Wow, 20 bucks just to drive you across town? Maybe I should be an Uber driver. I mean, I could use the extra money, and it's got to be easier than when I was delivering pizzas. All right, push. Push. Come on. Come on. Almost there. Almost there. Just one more push. Here it is. Oh, it's half Hawaiian. I believe that's ours. You poor fool. Hey, Stewie. What's up, big guy? None of the girls at school want to go to homecoming with me. Probably because everyone calls me names like Big Nips and Fat Nips and Big Fat Nips. Oh, don't listen to them Big Fat Nips. They're just being haters. What's a hater? Oh, it's just something people say instead of working to change their own flaws. Anyway, you just got to do what Taylor Swift does and shake it off. Who's Taylor Swift? Oh, my God. Am I about to introduce you to Taylor Swift? W what is she, a singer? She's much more than a singer, Chris. She's... She's... She's the queen! A goddess! A gazelle in a high-waisted swimsuit! Uh, sorry. If you're neither insane, nor clowns, nor a posse, I'm not interested. I have an idea. You should ask Taylor Swift to the homecoming dance. What? Why would she go to a dance with me? I'm telling you, this is exactly the kind of thing she would do. She's such a sweetheart. Oh, I'm going limp. Oh, I'm just going to lie here, moaning, thinking about Taylor Swift. Oh, oh, Tay-Tay. How would I even ask her? Oh, it's easy. You and I will just make a video about how sad you are and put it online. She's very interactive with all her fans. I guess it's worth a shot. Of course it is. If she says yes, you'll surprise everyone, just like you did on New Year's Eve. Three, two, one. Some animals give me boners. Hi, uh, I'd like to be an Uber driver. Okay, sure. Welcome aboard. Don't I... Don't I need to fill out a form? Or... Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Name, Peter Griffin. Criminal history. This section is optional. I will skip this. And done. Here you go. Yeah, none of this really matters. All I need to know is, do you have a car, a phone, and a face? It's my dog's car. Oh, and I know you didn't ask, but I am quick to anger. Okay, great. Now get out there and try to kiss as many ladies as you can. The record is 60 in a month. You, sir, are officially an Uber driver.